Welcome back, everybody. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and continue uh, a strategy that I showed earlier. It's called Two Face. And it's a very interesting strategy. We won $1,300 on it in literally 10 minutes. And it was the, it's the craziest strategy. And I was trying to perfect it. And based on just the way that the game is built, it is impossible to make it where it's vulnerable proof. You, it, it, there, w whether it's roulette or craps, there's always, there's always an advantage to the house, the way that the games are built. So there is no way to do that. So what I decided to do when we played it, we started at a really big dollar amount. So we're going to buy in for 5000 and we're going to start it on the $25 level. So what we're going to do is when we hit um, numbers like uh, that are not a 4, 5, 6, 8, 9, or 10, if you hit an 11, you hit a 12, you hit a 7, uh, or I mean a 5, 2, you hit any any number that's not in the box numbers you are going to lose so you have to go up on your bets on your box numbers so i gonna i'm gonna play it the only way that we can actually reverse the odds in our favor and get off the table on the come bet there those are hop bets for the six one four three we are not going to hop the five two it's impossible to do it if you do do it you have to sacrifice two of your box numbers and I'm not going to do that. So what we're going to do, we're going to go ahead and just start and see how it rolls out. Okay, now we do work every single roll. So we are on. Okay, so in 11, we're going to lose $20 there. Okay, so the Snake Eyes is also a loser, okay? Those are just two bad rolls, unfortunately, for us. So we're going to lose $20 again. So we're down $40 already. Okay, so we're off to a horrible start because we're only going to get $150. So whatever we lost here, over 150, we have to pay to the casino. Okay, it's another $20 loss, okay? All right, now what we're going to do, this is where we're going to change our odds against the casino, okay? Uh, the, math, the math is not going to change. We're just changing the likelihood that we're going to keep not rolling a box number, okay? So we're off to a horrible start. So what we're going to do is we're going to go up double on every one of those numbers, but we're going to keep our, our 6143 the same. Okay, here we go. Okay, so we're going to lose this $20. We don't lose any of our box numbers, okay? We're just, it's a very bizarre start. We've rolled two 11s, a snake eyes, a 437. So, you know, we haven't even hit a box number yet. Wow, this is unbelievable. Okay, we're going to take a big loss here. Okay, we had... Um, we had $10 each, right? So we're going to get 150 back and lose the rest. So we're going to have to go up really big on our box numbers.
We lost 185, guys. We're down like $250. This is the worst start. All right, we're going to bump our hops up just by one unit. It's only costing us an extra 10 to do that. So we got 15 each on the 6-1 and the 4-3. Okay, now what we've done is um, we still have not thrown one box number. We're 0 for like 5 on throwing one single come out number. Okay, so the odds are definitely in our favor here that we're finally going to hit one. If we hit a 4, that's going to really help us tremendously uh, or a 10. Okay. So what we're going to have to do now, because of the circumstances, we're going to have to do it two times before we can reduce these bets. Okay, we finally hit a box number. So we're going to lose this 30. Okay, that's going to pay 105 okay so in reality we made 75 dollars back okay we got to get one more hit now remember if we get a four or ten that's going to pay us 150 bucks okay we need another box number hit all right, we got it. Five, three, eight. We're gonna lose thirty, okay, and we're gonna get paid. Um, we got ninety dollars on there, okay. So we're gonna make another seventy-five dollar profit. That's after uh, should be one oh five, okay? Yeah. So we're gonna leave our thirty there. We're just gonna take seventy-five dollar profit. All right, so we got back 150, okay? We got back 150. Okay, so we're going to try to get one more hit. And we did it, 639, okay? We're going to take a $75 profit. That gets 105 minus 30 is $75 profit. All right, we've had three successful ones in a row, okay? So we've gotten back probably all of our money. So what we're going to do now is we're going to reduce it back down to level one. Now, guys, this strategy won $1,300 in nine minutes at the $100 level. So I'm confident that we're going to win again. We just need to do it smart. I'm trying to stabilize this strategy. All right, we have a lot. Uh, we took a lot of money off the board. Okay, we're back to ten dollars six one and four three hops. Got only twenty five across the board. Six and eight are at thirty. Here we go. Okay, we're gonna lose this twenty. Now you don't need to go up on one loss. You don't need to do that. Okay, that's $40. It's not what we want, but we're still not going to go up. Remember that any 4 or 10 gives you 50, and you'd have all your money back.
Okay, that's only a $15 profit. We're going to just try to grind this. Now, I'm going to remove the button because we're working every single roll. It doesn't matter what the button is. Oops, I'm going to put the 20 out there. We lose it. We keep rolling these weird, weird rolls. All right, we got to go up, guys. Eleven, we lose that thirty. It's so bizarre how many crap numbers we're hit. We're hitting nothing but elevens and threes and snake eyes. Very, very weird start to the session, okay? Very weird. Okay, that literally destroys us now we have to go really big to the hundred dollar level we just rolled a five two Okay, give me one second. This will pay us seven fifty. We got one, two, three, four, five, six. We got seven forty. Uh, we're a little too high. We're gonna come down a little. All right, we're good. Let's go. Dude, what is going on? Elevens, twos, threes, what the hell? All right, added a quarter to everything. All right, finally, we hit a four. Okay, we're going to get 250 and we lose this money here. All right, we're going to stay at this level. All right, back to back fours. Now we're back in business, okay? We've had a horrible start. Okay, we're going to try to get one more hit and then we're going to bring it down. Okay, we hit the eight. That's going to be perfect. Okay, we win 150, 160, 170, somewhere around there, but we lose the 50, 60, 70. So we make 100 profit. All right, I'm going to analyze our bankroll and see where we stand.
Guys, this is unbelievable. We're only down $100. That's amazing. For the start that we had, we're only down 100 So here's what we're going to do. We're going to go for the tie to get back into this thing and regroup. Okay, so you always need to analyze what you need to make your hop. So we got 100, 200, 300 and 320 dollars. And that is twenty dollars each. Okay, twenty dollars each will pay. Three hundred dollars. So we will lose twenty dollars if we hit a six one or a four three. Our goal is the box number. Okay, here we go. You don't want to overdo your six one four three. Okay, five. We're gonna win money. That's gonna pay seventy, and we lose um, forty. So that's a thirty dollar profit. Okay, another $30 profit. Okay, so we are only down $10. So we're going to reduce these bets. Okay, $35, we lose 20, so we make 15 bucks. All right, we're going to try to get off the table. We're going to try to get a couple hundred dollar win. We're going to keep going up. Okay, we get 70. We lose 30. Okay, we, we're going to get 70, we lose 30, we're going to take $40. We're making $40 every spin right now. Okay, that's even better. We get 100, we lose 30, we take 70. Now... Here's the smart way to play this, okay? This is called Two-Face. This is the smart way to play it. Every time that you get up in profits like that, you're better off bringing it back down. The reason why is that when you go through bad rolls of these 11s, 2s, things like that, you're only going to lose $20, $20, $20. If you hit a 5-2, you have to be able to over overcome it. And you can easily do that by, by being able to keep going up. And then win a couple, get your money back, go in profit, reduce it back down. Say what you want, but the strategy is about to be undefeated. And, and I tell you what, I think it's great. It's, if you manage it properly, you can win every time with it just about.
Okay, you get 50, you're gonna lose 20, so you make $30. So at this lower level, the last two rolls, you made 15 and 30, that's $45. Okay, that's that right there. You win 50, you lose 20. That's another $30. You've made $75 on the last three rolls at the lowest level one. Okay, we're gonna lose $20. Okay, we get 15 of that 20 we lost back, okay? We make another $15. Okay, we lose 20. Okay, we got 15 back. We get another 15. It's, we're, we're always going back in profit. Okay, the 617. This is going to force us to go up on our bets. Here we go. Watch. All your big chips are completely paid for by the 6-1 and the 4-3. You get all that money. The only thing you lose there is $20. You technically don't even have to go up. We only lose $20 there, people. $20. The only way I would have went up is if that was a 5-2 and I lost everything. We're not even going up. In one roll, we lost 20 on losing everything except because we had the hop. We're only, we're getting 15 now, so we only lost $5 for that whole seven out. Okay, there it is. The 5-2 is our kryptonite. That is going to make us go all the way up to the $100 level. Now watch how fast we get it back. Okay, we lost $180. Watch how fast we get it back on this system. Okay, we're ready to go. Here we go. Okay, that's an eight, right? Remember, we lost $180. Watch. Okay, we lose 70 for our hops, right? We got 120 on there. Hundred and forty, we lose seventy. So that's seventy dollars back. So we're down one ten from the previous one, okay?
Okay, we're gonna just take the profit, which is $70, okay? So we got, that's 140. We're only down $40 from the previous roll. Okay, because we're only down 40, watch what we do. Okay, I gotta analyze my 6 1 situation. We got 100, 200, 300, okay? 320, okay? I only gotta go $20 each. Now remember, we had to go through all this trouble just because we hit the kryptonite number, which is the 5 2. That is the kryptonite. Okay, guys, watch what happens. We're going to get 70. We lose 40. That's $30. We got back all of the money, and now we go down to the first level. All right, we're starting back again. Okay, guys, 35 minus 20, $15 profit. Now remember, you got to keep all of your profits, eat all the profits you've already won on the system, on, on the strategy. The 5-2 took it away temporarily. We got it all back and now we're going right back and building the same profits that we kept. So we already got $30 in profit. Even if we roll a non-box number, we only lose 20 of the 30 back. Even better, we hit the four. Your fours and tens are your bonus. 50 bucks minus 20, $30 profit. Remember, if we roll a 5-2 on level one, we only lose $20. We've already paid already for a 5-2 and several missed uh, odd numbers. We've already paid for it on this shooter. Dude, this strategy is awesome. This two-phase strategy is freaking awesome. Another four. 50 bucks, 20 bucks. We went 30 again. Another four, another 30 bucks. So guys, check this out. Based on level one, we only lose $20 if a 5-2 comes. We lose all our money and we only lose... Oh, I'm sorry. I take that back. I, I apologize. That's not true. On a 5-2... Whoa, I'm way off. I, I said something wrong earlier. On a 5-2, you lose every single thing. All your profits that you had made or whatever is gone, okay? It's gone. That's the only thing that stops you is a 5-2. There's nothing else that stops you. The 5-2 is the kryptonite. So you do have to go ahead and go into the, le the ladder level system to get it back. And you will get it back. You would have to have 5-2, 5-2, 5-2 not to get it back. Okay, so this is what I meant. This is what I meant right here. You only lose $20 when you hit a 7, a 4, 3, or a 6, 1. That's what I meant, not the 5, 2. So check this out. 6, 1, right? Watch.
you only lose $20 on level one. On level two, you're only going to lose $40 when you hit sixes and seven, uh, uh, the sevens, except for the five two. The 6-1 and 4-3 does not even require you to go up on your level. It doesn't even do that. Because one roll, you get back 95% of it. Boom. You lost 20. You just got back 15 on one roll. Going to lose $20. I'm just going to give them $20. Gonna lose another twenty dollars. I'm gonna go up now on my on my box numbers. Because it's gonna be too hard to keep getting it back at fifteen dollars. I want more money. Here we go. You just go up one unit on your six one and uh, four three. You go up one unit on your box numbers, okay? All you need to do is get one hit, and you can go right back down to level one. There's your one hit. We're going to go ahead and analyze what we made, okay? We're going to get $70. We're going to lose $30. That's $40, which was the money that we just lost two in a row on. We reduce it right back to level one. Guys, your boy figured out Two-Face, dude. I told you I would. This strategy is freaking awesome. Okay, we're going to lose $20. We're just going to repeat the bet. All we need is one hit to get back 95% of that. Five two seven, the worst number in the whole strategy. Our kryptonite Superman just ran into Luke's leather, whatever the heck his name was. So here's what we got to do: we have to bump it up to get that one hundred and eighty dollars back. Let's go. I'm gonna keep those losses on the field so you can see how fast we get it back. Okay, an eight. That's going to be a $70 profit. We're going to take it from here. A four. That's $200 minus 70. Okay, that's a $130 profit. I'm going to take it from here. They owe us $20. We're $20 back in profit. The 5-2 never happened. We're back to level one. Yes, your boy is the best craps player in the world. The most creative mind. Let's go. Give me the $15. Give me the $15. Now, guys, what I like about playing this small ball, this is very, very comfortable level here. 
The only thing that makes you go up is a 5-2. That is the only thing that makes you go up. Other than that, you can go up one level. You The 5-2 the makes you go from the first level all the way to level 4. If you get picked off on a 5-2, it makes you go up three levels. That's all you got to remember. Analyze the units, and you got to go up three more levels. Okay, if you got to go from one to four, if you get picked up at four, you got to go from four to eight. Got it? That's it. Or four to seven. You'd have to calculate it. Four, three, seven. We only lose $20. Don't even have to go up. Got back 15 out of the 20 that you just lost. Got back 15. You're now $10 up more than when the 7 happened. All right. So here's the deal. When you play this at the $100 level... And you have a hundred, or I'm sorry, when you play this, well, we didn't play at the hundred dollar level, guys. Go back and look at the strat the strategy uh, where it's titled, um, where I just made it was, uh, we were doing 200, 200, 240, 240, 200, 200, 100 hop, 100 hop. That's the strategy that won. It's the same strategy, but it won 11 or $1,300 in 10 minutes, Okay. We're playing the grinding, realistic way for most of us to play, all right? This is a grinding, realistic way, which is what I needed to bring you, but I needed to perfect it because it's a brand new strategy. I literally just pulled this out of you know where. But the more that I'm playing it, and now that I've put it together in a, an intelligent way, this sucker is awesome, dude. This sucker is awesome. It, we're not going to win a lot of money here because we're betting tiny. But we're still made a profit. So let's do the calculation now. Okay, $340 profit. We played this at level one. The only thing we did when we got picked off, if we don't get picked off by the 5-2, but you can't look at it that way. You're going to have some 5-2s. It's part of this strategy, okay? You're not going to prevent a 5-2 from coming, all right? Now, when I'm playing this strategy, I'm going to be the shooter because I can promise you when I dice set, I hit maybe... 1% 1 on 5-2s, maybe 2% of the time, 2%. 5-2s is not a part of my 6-2, six 6-2 two, six two dice set. I very rarely throw a 5-2. That is why I'm trained to, to hop the 6-1-4-3. Because if I throw a 7 when I'm the dice shooter, I promise you 98% of the time it's going to be a 6-1 or a 4-3. So this is the perfect strategy for me when I'm the dice setter and I'm playing this strategy. All right. Now, if you get unlucky with the 5-2s, guys, just have the bankroll to be able to bail you out. All you need to do is risk it for two, two rolls. If you hit the 4s and 10s, you don't even have to risk it for two. You can get out after one. That It's that simple. 
All right, guys, thanks for watching. I really love this strategy. I'm definitely gonna play this more and more and more and practice it more and more and more when I'm comfortable. If I wanna make bigger money, I can go up, but I don't like to force going up. I want it to happen naturally, and the only way that's gonna happen is I hit five twos, but I don't stay at that level. I go right back down. I try to play it safe. I'd rather have 350 bucks here for free and play for, for 20 minutes and get off the table. Sometimes you're not even gonna experience a 5-2 where you're able to get off the, t the table in 10 minutes and you didn't even have any stress. Thanks for watching, guys. Give me a like, subscribe, and I'll see you on the next one.